so ba 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 bo But anyways, for the first stunt since uh, oh wow, I can't speak today. What's up everybody? It's Thunder here of HG Central and welcome to part 10 and what is the very last part of Stuntman? Well, there's only really one thing we have left to show off, and that is of course the stunt constructor mode. So let's get into that. As you can see, the stunt constructor mode just takes us right to the arena that you've already seen now several times within the game. Uh, and if you just don't press anything, it'll just put some cameras around and show that. You have to just press X to get to the constructor thing. So you have a whole bunch of features here. You have to choose toy, play, edit arena, save, load, clear, yada yada. The help there, just showing that really quickly for the commands for you guys. And of course, the a lot of toys. Now, the things that we were unlocking in the career mode, this is where you get them. This is the toys. And because we've already beaten career mode, we've already unlocked all of them. And I will be going through each and every one, showing like a little demonstration of what each one is. I'm not going to be talking during them, I'm just going to be showing off what they were and there'll be some music playing. But uh, in the edit mode, you can just... You're basically the red marker, and you can rotate it around and around and around like a Ferris weight. No. <laughs> you can just rotate it around and whatnot. Over here is this little uh, pad with an arrow. The pad with the arrow is actually where you start. Now, for years, I always thought it would ha you, it was just there. You couldn't really put it anywhere, but I was wrong. You actually can move it and place it around. I'm just showing off how you can do that. Of course, you can move it there. So for example, just here, and you use the uh, L1 and R1 buttons to r rotate it. The uh, anal right analog st left and right analog sticks for certain things. Left analog stick to move around, right for rotation. The L1 and R1 to rotate the actual object, and L2 and R2 to zoom in clo uh, closer or far further back. The closer you are at, the slower you can move, move around, and the f further you are at, the faster it goes. Pretty self-explanatory. So, you can just basically do that. You can duplicate it by just having this, the item appear. Uh, you can't do that too much, though, because unfortunately there is an item limit. You can only have a certain amount of items before the game's like, that's too much on the map. It's stupid, I know. And then, of course, there's the drop and delete, you, which is pretty self-explanatory. Then you can save arenas, load arenas, clear, which you get the idea of all of these, and replays if you've saved them. So let's just jump right into it. I've already made a little montage to show you all the stunts with all the different cars, so hope you guys enjoy this part.
and that pretty much forms the basis of well the uh, the uh, stuns you can do now. As you probably noticed earlier, I actually had a couple arenas I could load in the load arena. And the funny thing is I didn't really even remember much of them, so I thought as a bonus, why not show them off, as I'm going to do here, of course. This one is just pretty much a whole bunch of series of ramps that I just put side by side, nothing much else to it. Um, so I thought I'd just mention a couple things to uh, mention about the uh, stun constructor mode. As you probably see, a lot more parts can exactly fall off your car. There seems to be a greater damage physics in this uh, this mode, including the fact that doors and even wheels can fall off the car. Yes, literally the wheels can fall off the car. You don't want to lose your front wheels because then you can't steer. Don't think you can lose your rear wheels though. And um, even in some cases, if you total out, you're, the entire engine will come out. Which I thought was a pretty nifty thing. So yeah, this mode just... You can pretty much make whatever kind of stunts you want to do. So it's why I really like it like that. So I thought I'd just show off the second one here, which I did kind of remember once it loaded the bus ramp. I kind of made my own version of the uh, one from this career mode, just with less bosses because I can't fit them all because it won't let me. And well, might as well show off this uh, last one here with the bus jumps because why not? And that's the landing. <laughs> I think I did this uh, a long time ago, just testing out how many cars could actually make uh, the jump from where the land, the uh, starting pad was. So, yeah, there's not much to really explain here, apart from the fact that I just let my car hang there and then slowly push the bus out of the way, make this the, this car spot. Now that bus can go fuck off. <laughs> So yeah, that is pretty much going to, for the most part, cover up Stuntman, and there's the clear arena you can see there, and just... So yeah, you could pretty much just make whatever you want, really want to do with this mode, and it's a lot of fun. So, yeah, like I said, that's gonna cover Stuntman, there's really not much else to show off, apart from maybe the replay, which I will show off here. And I thought I'd just show the replay off because you actually get a whole bunch of uh, extra camera angles that you can't get in other replays. Only this mode has it, which is uh, pretty interesting. But basically, it's pretty fun just to watch it. And of course, if you enjoy the replay that you see, you can obviously save it. Hence the load replay option that was shown earlier on. So, yep, like I mentioned earlier, that's going to cover it for Stuntman. And, well, uh, what's my next game? Well, I'm going to be making another straw poll where you guys can vote on my next game. It'll probably have some of the other nominations that were on the first one that didn't get chosen to give them, like, a second chance. And probably a couple other new games. So, yeah, thank you guys for watching so much. I hope you guys enjoyed this uh, playthrough of Stuntman. Very fun game. Still ranks in one of my top ten favorite racing genre games. And take care, guys. On YouTube's EnterGameAnyone.com, I'll leave you out with the uh, left, what's left over of this replay.